yes is the um the year 2020 happy new year to you scorpions i want to say thank you for being here thank you for supporting my channel um scorpions um this is the year of uh, um the divine mother and father and this is a new start so you can search or you scorpions are definitely going to be receiving a new uh, chance okay um scorpions this is the right positive time in this year on um, new changes and in order to ex uh, to receive my extended readings you have to use the link here or the link there to connect with uh, um, the extended part of this and um, I want to say to each and every person thank you thank you so much for being here thank you for the wonderful positive energy that you have sent to me and I, I want to say to each and every one a treat this year because it's a year of a new start and see how it goes in the month of uh, January you have the energy of the magician you are a water sign and it's a hair sign year so the magician is going to be helping you to resolve some situation unexpected help is going to be coming in for some of you scorpion to resolve a situation in the month of February, a good situation balance comes in where the earth energy sign come in to give you some balance in the month of February. So this is really wonderful and really positive because you're going to be balancing out situation with people around you. OK, whatever that was transpiring, you're coming in this year having luck in the first month to resolve certain situation and balance in the second month and this is wonderful as we look at uh, the month of march you are dealing with uh, um the energy of uh, um your boss your father or people in power now whatever the situation is it's obvious to someone in an organization that has used their powers and you're dealing with this and i'm seeing that you're going to be having a miraculous resolution to an issue so if we look at this first quarter it's not really bad for you scorpions because i'm seeing unexpected help is coming in as we look at um um April April you have another earth energy so there's a lot of um, earth energies that is coming in to balance you because you're in a water element and the earth energies and the earth elements are coming in and they are here in February and is coming back for you in the month of April so this is really wonderful and positive may is good because may you're finally going to be released out of a situation and you are going to be free in may so whatever that you have been dealing with you're finally being released out of a situation and in may you are going for a new start so this is a positive as we move on i see in june another positive month you are going to be financial stable i see unexpected money coming to you in june whatever that was happening and transpire um unexpected money is going to be coming in um this is a, a money that was supposed to be paid out to you from um people who have used their powers against you and this is good i see that uh, this was something like a house has been sold for some of you. So if you are looking to sell a house, I see that if you had divorced and you were waiting for the final payment, I saw that coming in. So the first six months, Scorpions, that is really looking good. I see um, new changes. I see help coming in. You guys have a good reading. Success come for you in July, whatever the success is, money and success june is the money prosperity and abundancy and in the month of july i see you're successfully overcoming a situation that has transpired with you i see the energy of the lover i see you're going to be reconnecting some of you could be getting married in august or some of you could be meeting your twin flame or soulmate this is wonderful because i see you going on a new journey so some of you could be getting married in august so in august some of you really could be getting married then i see um whatever that has transpired uh it's definitely marriage is coming up i see some of you could be married in a, a um a family of money this is transpiring so i see a situation is also 
healing and balancing coming in September and this is going to be good okay I see a judgment call is coming out whatever is coming out in October we are going to see if it's good it look as if it's good but um, whatever information you're going to be receiving in October yes it's good victory and success scorpions I really like this because a lot of you have been going through so many situations a lot of you have been going through so much situation and the last energy is that all the secrets that was kept is going to be coming out in December it doesn't have to be in December it's different for each person so you have your own energy in this year scorpion it's as if you're cleaning up things but luck is coming in for you your own energy is in um, the year 2020 you're vibrating under your own energy vibration the energy of uh, the debt and this is good because uh, I see um transition is coming in also with a contract so whatever is happening I definitely see some transition and and it's, it's uh, positive okay so whatever is transpiring is very positive all right let me give you your bad months because and there is a scorpion there's actually no bad months you scorpions have like the best reading there's actually no bad month the, the, the month of december is just that whatever secrets there was because the gemini the 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 magician is bringing out the energy of help unexpected help just miraculously and then you're ending with the energy of the moon all right so this is good for you scorpion and i see the energy and um, some of you are going to get married you're going to be happy you're going to be moving forward and this is good so i see the energy of the magician coming in and giving you guys a new start and bringing balance in your life i see you releasing yourself from something that someone has used their power and you're going to be successful i see success victory and success so i see some of you buying houses i see some of you buying new cars i see some of you winning lawsuit and that sort of a thing and you will be paid out there we go i said it i said it i said it so unexpectedly january um, february money is going to be coming in unexpectedly a whole lot of money is going to be coming in january february and i see a whole lot of communication with people in the corporation and organization whatever that was there and transparent i see a whole lot of communication coming at you guys i see if you have a business i see business is going to be very successful another money card wow pisces oh um, okay scorpion sorry oh my god scorpion there is money so i see balance is coming in and you start with your financial situation wow i told you because this money would have come in in june but it's coming in in january and april and may wow i told you some of you were going to buy a house or sell a house so in the month of may june some of you are going to think about buying a house or selling a house i see the communication starting from a february march and you are going to be receiving the house so if you are planning on buying or selling a house or starting a business i see you're going to have the money to do that uh, scorpions you're looking good then we have the nine of cups okay scorpions <laughs> I think that Capricorn was have, going to have the best year, but oh my God, your wishes and dreams is coming true, Scorpion. Bam, bam. Oh no. The Wheel of Fortune is here. Scorpion, if you ever waste your year, I swear, you are going to be one of these lucky people in this year. You are one of the luckiest sign of the water sign. So whatever is happening, especially if you have Jupiter in your chart, OMK. Nine of Swords, I see some of you worried. Some of you receive a message and you're worried, but you're going to be overcoming this message. And you are going to be receiving some worrisome information in the month of October, but you're going to overcome this here. Here you go. You're going to be victoriously, successfully overcoming this. I told you. Whew, okay, I got it. I, I, I got to let you see this. 
unbelievable scorpions but after that horrible 2019 that you had mm -mm -mm. after you're going to receive some worrisome message and then you're going to overcome it because i see you're victorious and successful you have victory some of you are going to definitely buy a car definitely buying a car a house i see you going on vacation i see people getting married um that sort of energy is coming out people getting married and that sort of a situation so scorpion you are really really looking good in this year i see positive alignment of energy whatever the deceptiveness and the lies and the deceptiveness that was going on i i, I see if either this whatever this message is that is coming in you're just gonna be shaking it off and said oh I'm not really um, um, jumping about this okay so I see a new house you scorpion are going to buy a new house starting a new business I see you have strong foundation dealing with a situation I see um, your wishes and dream and marrying someone is going to be coming up um, whatever is transpiring 999 because I see the energy of 999, I see the 10 of pentacles, whatever is transpiring. I see the energy of the 10 of pentacles. I see the three of cups, um, this sort of a situation that is happening. And your wishes and dreams are going to be coming in. Long, um, um, strong foundation. Um, you're going to be financially um, strong foundation, financially good. Wheel of fortune where I see that your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true and the wheel of fortune in january bam 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 money is coming up um scorpion mm, 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 scorpion in january the ten of pentacles and money is coming up luck is in the month of february with a, a corporation um luck is there i see news coming in luck i see an invitation coming in from people in um power um and this invitation this is wonderful i see balance you are going to be very very successful um you scorpions i see a new start and success is coming up another time the energy so may is going to be unexpectedly may and money is going to be coming in long-term stability is going to be here i see so, so many success is happening for you scorpions okay i see healing the emotion because your emotion your financial stability is going to be good so you're healing the emotion i see ladies you are going to be so happy ladies i see happiness ladies you're going to be successfully coming out of a situation i see people um connecting with their friends i see um people um, moving in with their best friend marrying to their best friend I see financial stability I see happiness and joy is coming in I see success with a situation where some of you um, were vi violated I see peace coming in with a legal issue whatever is transpiring I see peace coming in with a legal issue I see they found out exactly what that was happening transformation multiple offers is going to be coming in and i see if you have a business i see a lot of offers coming in in october and you're worried so that was what the worries was for a lot of uh, offers is coming in in october and you were worried if you can manage all the offer and this is for business people so october i see a lot of offers coming in i see a resolution to a, 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 a situation with a car if there was an issue with a car i see you buying a new car i see some of you buying the car of your dreams your dream car the wheel of fortune is bringing this and i see you buying that dream car unexpected luck is going to be coming in i see you celebrating in december this is so corrupted scorpions scorpions long-term stability scorpions scorpions i am telling you scorpions you have had such a horrible year last year scorpions an unbelievable year that was it, it was unbelievable okay and you scorpions oh you guys have like one of the best best reading i have to take a i have to take a picture of this and what is 
what is happening? It is as if your fairy godmother come wave the one because you're vibrating in your own energy vibration. It's as if a fairy godmother came and waved the one. This is your own energy vibration in this year. And I see that if you use it correctly, Scorpion, OMK, OMG. A lot of you are going to be buying your dream car. A lot of you are going to be buying your dream house. A lot of you are going to be successful. Uh, it's, uh, no, unexpected, okay? Ten of Pentacles in January. Expect some money to come in in January. In January, there is going to be the energy of the Ten of Pentacles. I see self, um, happiness. I see joy. I see you marrying to your friend. I see you building a strong foundation. I see the Wheel of Fortune and the Nine of Cups together. Happiness, oh my. Um, twice the sun. Twice the sun. Twice the sun. Um, oh my God, each and every month. And this is what I said. I don't see that any month was, because even the month of October, the month of October is just, you were worried because you received so much offers and you were wondering if you could have uh, um, clear up these offer. But I see January money is shedding in. Um, luck is here and um, with an organization, you're going to be having luck with an organization. I see an, an invitation to people in power is going to be bringing that. I see the stars, the energy of the stars is just so fabulous because the energy of the star is standing here and hanging here what i'm seeing is that so whatever is transpiring i am seeing that you are going to be extremely successful with it, uh, with money coming in um a situation with a house you're buying a house you're selling a house um property if you are going to do property scorpion this is going to be good emotionally you're sitting pretty Whatever is transpiring with you, Scorpion, emotional, you're sitting pretty. Long term stability, you're sitting pretty. Then we see the energy of the house. Whatever that has been happening and transpiring, I see success for you women. I see your wishes and dreams are coming in. Money is going to be coming in. Some of you are going to be married. Oh my God, this is good. The last month, December, unexpected luck. And you are going to be celebrating coming over a deceptive situation that has transpired. Release yourself of worries. Whatever you Scorpions was worried about, there is no need to worry. Let it go. This year is absolutely fabulous. Okay. So let's see the animal that is coming up for what animal is going to be um, coming up for you, uh, Scorpio, what animal is going to be coming up for you, Scorpions? Okay, so let's see. Uh, okay, so we have an earth animal coming up here. We have the elk and the gazella. The elk and the gazella. Okay, the elk and the gazella. Okay, so, oh my God, those are two beautiful um, animals, the elk and the gazella. Wow, that is beautiful. That is definitely, um, uh, that is definitely a hurt. The gazella is really a fire energy, okay? So the gazella comes up with a fire energy. And the energy of the gazella, I'm just call upon these animals, um, to help you. Whatever the issue is and the situation is the energy of the gazella is here it's a fire energy you are what a sign but i see um that the fire energy is coming in and it's helping you guys and it's going to be god so the gazella um it is a heightened awareness and ability vulnerability the gazella represents super grace with every move this awesome inspiration beauty immense sociology okay sophistication and elegant gazelle presenter are often hyper 
of their surrounding. Okay, so they're always hyper of their surroundings, what is happening. All those uh, um, predators out there in the wide world. When the cards appear, it's time to get back to presenting a moment, sitting down, finding your breath and acknowledging the bounty that surrounds you. Let it nourishes your gentle spirit. So, in balance, grace and uh, perceptive, artistic. When out of balance, foolish allegations, allega in Zormia, race in mine, yen, the yin and yen, or you can just uh, eat good food, okay? So this is good because that animal is teaching you grace and this is really, really, really wonderful um, what is transpiring. So the elk, uh, the elk is an uh, earth energy. Um, the elk comes up for you guys, which is beautiful. And most of you had your own animal energy vibration. And I'm guided to use this more and more so people can become very familiar with what has happened and transpired. So the elk, the energy of the elk, stability, resilient, it's strong, the father. So the elk is um, the father energy. The great elk represents the hurt, the element in its masculine form. This means it provides uh, underlying support and uh, stability amidst the life of many, many changes. Okay, so this is a father figure and it has to do with uh, sometimes the elk ego can become inflated by um, just being there because you're a father. But for the most of the time, they make damn good fathers, mother, lovers, and friends. The world needs more elf energy. Supportive, kind, and consistent. Representing I and mighty. To bring into balance, eat and drink more. Okay, so this is good. Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful, ladies and gentlemen. The, you guys have the best animals, the best year it's unbelievable. I wasn't expecting this after what I saw that went through last year. Uh, then we have the energy Archangel Shamuel, uh, the energy of the third chakra. So you're going to be working with Archangel Shamuel in this year, the energy of the third chakra. So whatever the issue, the situation that was going on, the energy of the third chakra is here. And this is a wonderful alignment of energy. So be aware of what has been happening and transpiring. This is going to be good. The third chakra, number 37. I, again, um, Pisces and uh, Scorpion. <sighs> Money. <laughs> you have twice the nine of pentacles, ten of pentacles. Uh, Twelve of cup, wheel of fortune. Long-term stability with money, selling a house, buying a house, material. I love your hair. I absolutely, absolutely love your hair. Raphael, Archangel Raphael, come in. There needs to be more communication. Whatever the issue in the situation is, um, there really needs to be more communication. Whatever that has to inspire for you guys, you're going to overcome this. But it, there needs to be more communication. So whatever the deceptiveness that was at play, um, you need to understand that there needs to be more communication that is happening and that is transpiring. So we need to open up and we need to realize what exactly has transpired, the deceptiveness at play and how you need to heal a situation and communicate, okay? Scorpions, I love you guys. Gotta go, gotta go. Mm -hmm.